Swallowed by water, this vital farmland remains an inland sea. For weeks, flooding has devastated communities across Assam, in India's northeast and in neighbouring Bangladesh. All the houses here have been damaged by floods. Our wheat, rice, hens, cows, everything has drowned. The floods even took away the fish from the fisheries. More than 150 people have been killed in the disaster. Thousands of villages have been affected and millions of people have been displaced. Flood affected people will return to their houses with their families when the water recedes. I have 100 to 150 houses in my ward. All of them are mud houses and all of them have been damaged. With crops inundated, many families are struggling to find food. The floods washed away crops like wheat and rice. We couldn't even harvest them. The receding waters have left a trail of destruction in their wake. Locals have been forced into makeshift housing. We are breaking ourselves every day and going through extreme difficulties. The government is not providing us much relief. There are no proper roads left. Farmers are trying to save what they can, but for those whose livelihoods rely on cultivating the land, the floods will have long-term consequences. Sarah-Jane Bell, ABC News.